The file upload question lets people attach files up to 16 megabytes to their response. It's the perfect question if you need people to add images, documents, or even GIFs to their response. And there's no storage limit, so you can keep as many files in your account as you'd like. Let's learn how to set up your question and how to manage your files later on. After you add a file upload question to your survey, type your instructions at the top. You can also add extra instructions below, but this is optional, so feel free to leave it blank if you want. Then choose what file types you'd like to allow. So if you only want people to upload images or photos, uncheck all the options except for PNG and JPEG. The validation message will automatically adjust below, but you can also edit it if you want to. You can only upload one file to each question, so if you need people to add more files, you'll need more file upload questions. The quickest way to do that is to click copy and quickly duplicate your questions below. You can add up to 20 file upload questions to a survey. When you view your results, you'll see your files nestled under the file upload question. If you know the exact file that you're looking for, you can find it quickly using the search bar. And if the file is an image, click on the file to preview it. Looks good? Then quickly download it to your device by clicking the download tab. And if you're not sure who the file belongs to, click view respondents answers to see the rest of their answers. You'll need to delete the full response if you want to delete a file, but we give you unlimited storage, so you keep all your files for as long as you'd like.